hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel uh guys uh as always i will start uh by thanking you all for new subscriptions new comments new likes uh i'm really, really grateful for them and i'm happy to and motivates me to do uh like next things for you uh it it has been like three weeks since uh, my last video and yeah uh, almost three weeks you yeah, right so but this is how usually how long it takes me to create anything new right so and just test it hardly and and to give you something proven that works that uh, you will have fun with and and yeah and etc and, and and whenever it comes for me uh to create a new tactic information i always go and reach to my dearest friend Amar, who is uh, also a coach on our website and he's helping me with the testing and stuff and giving his opinion about it and how it worked for him and guys believe me we are coaches uh of fifa you know on our website but we're not like the greatest player and <laughs> we are already old <laughs> both of us and our time reaction is not the same as it used to be so all those youngsters who can do they, they can just you know do much more than we do but if why i'm where i'm going with this if we manage to get a good results with this formation not scaling all the time and just using the passing options and stuff uh i believe I, i'm i'm positive that you will have success successes with this formation and tactics also and i always believe it's always fun to try something new especially when it comes to the end of the cycle of fifa so and uh, going back to our results amar got 18 and 2 last weekend with this tactic information i got 14 and 0 so yeah i mean i, I think those are like results in good enough to 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 make a video about it and it was tested like three weeks almost with this formation and tactics to to so uh i stopped at the 14 and 0 just to get a little bit uh, better luck with uh, untradeable pack uh, i thought it's gonna be like that but uh, unfortunately it wasn't worth it uh guys um I need to admit that halfway uh, through the process of preparation and, and, uh, and doing this formation and, and work, uh, basically, I, I went to YouTube, watched a couple uh, videos of tier list, uh, formation tier lists, and I found this formation that we're gonna, I'm gonna present to you today at the bottom. Like every tier list, it was at the bottom, and I'm like, I, I damn, I hope they're gonna click it. I hope they're gonna watch it at least and give it a try because it's a fun formation. It's in something different than um the, than um, all those given meta fun, meta ones right so i hope you will enjoy it right um also what i want to tell you is i tried this formation before a couple times and uh i have to be honest with you i struggle with it also and it didn't it didn't work for me i couldn't just figure out how to make it uh balanced defensively and great offensively and it it just shows that it, right now it was possible of two main main things it the, the one is that we have so many new cards uh boosted cards and and great cards right now in the game with uh, so much increased stats on them and the second thing it was one change of the instruction uh which i've never tried before and even if i did it wasn't in the correlation or configuration with other instructions so that that gave me the the uh chance to to make this formation work the way i intend to right so okay um let's move on to the tactics i know my videos are always too long so this one are probably gonna be the same uh this one this this time i'm gonna show you the tactics on web app uh it's just easier for me i i still don't have that card that you know transferred the video from playstation I'm working on it uh, on the fonts on it uh maybe next time it's gonna be already like that but right now i'm gonna show the tactics on web app i think it's gonna be clear enough for you guys okay so formation as we're discussing today it's four five one but bracket two uh quickly just let's go through tactics defensive style balance and i strongly suggest you guys to not use any press uh on this formation any pressing uh style because the positioning of your players is just not right for the pressing options right with 30 i would stick with a 30 width in defense that you can experiment between 40 and 60 i wouldn't go higher than 60 i wouldn't lower go lower than 40 actually uh build up fast play uh build up you know guys know me um 
I'm a thinker that I want to get out of my half as quick as possible, right? And uh, the fast buildup, it just helps me out with it. And this time, uh, change creation, I didn't go for possession because I want all my players make runs. And forward runs creates those runs for me, even when I'm not triggering, right? Uh, with, I'm sticking with 71 but feel free to uh, uh, experiment with that. Uh, I wouldn't go lower than 50. This is a white formation. We have to use it as a white formation and we're going to use it more side sides of the pitches. Uh, I will show you like I will show you in examples if you stick to the end, uh, not the middle. All right. And player in the box three. It's also the reason why it's low. It's just I want to secure this lonely CM in this <laughs> in this team. Uh, uh, who is playing? Uh, will show you who is playing for me that role, uh, just to give him a chance to stay back because he's, he's still gonna be involved in attack. But this is like I don't want all of them to get into the box. I want to have a little bit space for me for striker for camps to work one v one situation and make those isolation isolations uh, plays, which are like we know the, the, one of the ways to score in this in this game, right? Let's just jump into player instructions, guys. This is my team, current team. This is how exactly I line up and play in in, uh, in a game, right? So uh, we'll start with goalie. Just a couple of things. As you know, I'm always using come from castle sweeper keeper, but this time I was searching for a goal goalie who has two traits. Uh, rush out of goal, it calls, I think, and come for crosses, except explanatory. I think with that rush out of the goal, the sweeper keeper has more, uh, it's working better, uh, for me at least. Um, nothing on center backs, uh, no reason to show you. As you can see, nothing on the center backs in the second one either. So this time I'm not using, but uh, we're going to have a little bit different instructions on fullback. Both going to join the attack, but one is going to be inverted and it's going to be on our, uh, our right side. And our left side is going to be also join the attack, but on overlap. OK, uh, main thing, main CDM, CM slash uh, stay back, uh, stay on edge, free roam and cover center. And one important thing. I advise you to find a player who has low or medium attacking work rates and high defensive work rates just to have at least uh, like opportunity to for him to stay back right I, I want him to stay back and distribute the ball um, the reason I gave him free run because I don't have a CDM uh, as a main position in this formation because if I had if I would have, uh, I would use deploy and maker, deploy, deploy and playmaker. Sorry, my English is not my first language. So, uh, so free rom is a kind of substitution for that deploy and playmaker. He shows up for the ball. He's making those passes. The player also that you're looking for here, it's a toe who can intercept with a reach. I tried uh, Verati here. He's great, but sometimes. He, his height is and with because of his height he's missing a lot of uh, interceptions uh, interception possibilities right so that's why uh, biscuits uh, sbc came just on time for this formation for me uh, the other player that i use uh, over here it was tonali but they use him on the engine he has enough speed for, for me and i was just was uh, was going to increase his passing stats because these players are gonna you, you need them to have a great passing options right uh, passing stats, sorry. Uh, okay, left mid. There are also left mid and right mid. I don't like the symmetric plays on both sides. That's why I'm a little changing. So uh, I suggest you to use your attacking one of CMs. If you play three uh, three CM formations, one of the attacker uh, you can put on a, as a left mid player. He's gonna come back, and uh, when he's come coming back to defend, he's gonna be as a left midfielder. In defense, cut inside, come short, stay on edge. Don't worry about stay on edge. He will still, if he sees the opening, and I think I have an example of it, he will still jump into the box and basically unmarked uh, usually and have a scoring opportunity that's why i'm saying use the if you're using a cm over here or cam with a defensive stats i prefer 
but also who can finish uh, in the box or outside the box with a Trivella shot uh, or, 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 or any other shot that you use, power shot and stuff. Okay, right mid, uh, a little bit different instruction. He's also gonna come back as gonna be our right mid and the whole formation is gonna defend in 4 for 2 Maybe you are tired of defending 4 for 2 uh, I can understand that, but uh, I think it's the most balanced way to defend. At least for me, it's in, 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 my, in my opinion, this is the best like lineup for defending right i find myself uh it, it it just gives me more chances to defend not m make big mistakes with the uh, player rotation and and switching and stuff so he's gonna come back as a right mate on defense stay wide this time and the rest i left on balance i'll just rely on ai and forward runs of the tactic given uh, main tactic instruction right okay those uh, cams are our strikers they're both gonna stay forward and get into the box for cross nothing else uh, I have this is my own preference I have on the left side free roam uh, it's it's up to you 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 can you can just uh, if it's not gonna work for you or you're not a fan of free roam just you, you can take it off and use the same instruction as on a uh, right side of the player so stay forward and get into the box and the main player uh, as you can see i'm using pedri as a striker yeah it's not a mistake and by instruction given to him he's our attacking cm actually when we are defending he's gonna uh, come close to the midfield and defend next to our cm cdm slash biscuits over here uh, and with uh, Modric on the left side and Rodrigo uh, in this case on the right side, they're gonna create the four midfield uh, defensive line. And yeah, then uh, Abraham and Saka over here is gonna stay forward as strikers. And instructions, um, one more thing, so I not forget, I uh, use high high players. I want him as fast to be back and cover the the runs off all and defend and the same way i want him to just get involved in attack right because he still is like uh our our striker right he's not gonna be too deep in front uh he's gonna act because we're giving him also instruction false nine so stay central false nine come back on defense he's our kind of cam in this role cf cam there is no center forward position in, in real life but it doesn't matter uh so he's our attacking cm that just ended this way and he's gonna defend next to our cdm position okay so if you are tired already watching this video and don't want to go through examples and want to just jump in and right away uh, try it on feel free okay uh be my guest the the reason i want you to stick with and watch the examples because i will you will see how i play this formation and how to utilize it to benefit you the most but if you don't want to see the examples uh i will give you just uh, three steps how to use it first step when you get the ball guys uh you go to the wing and from wing you go into the middle from from middle the second step you're going to the wing again you working your uh, chances on the wing because there you have advantage you will outnumber your player your opponent on the wings and when you get closer to the box you just go to the middle and find your striker i know i'm simplifying it but this is just a cut like three steps of how quickly to get to the to the opponent box and create chances right Not, don't go through middle like um don't work your chances through middle you you use your mid uh, midfielders like Pedri in my case and Biscuits only to distribute the ball in the first phase of building up to the wings okay that's why I'm using great passing uh, passing stats players over here who has like great stats of, uh, and can pass like both legs would be great uh, so so they can cross they can pass short and I just want to make sure that those two players will just distribute the ball the, 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 the right way eh? race okay so let's just jump in two examples i prepared to you i prepared today 12 examples i know it's a lot but if you want to see all of them and and and, and just uh, uh watch how i play this formation i feel uh, i'll be more than happy to show you that okay okay let's start with the first example they're gonna be drawings again okay we're gonna stop in the first example and okay i marked already with a uh, white marker uh, both sides of the pitch uh, and you can see i have two players against one defender on the left side two players against one defender on the right side 
showing you that I already have advantage on the sites and I'm gonna take advantage and I'm gonna use it right to, to, to benefit me in build up but uh, of course you can go straight uh, straight to the to the sites but I usually use the reason I have great pedri uh, as a passing uh, player and biscuits of uh, in the midfield I want to use them uh, it also what it does it just Mm, a little bit narrows the opponent formation right for me and creates uh, creates openings on the sides even more so whenever i get the ball my first uh, uh, plan is to find one of those players uh, and then distribute the ball to the wings okay so this is what we're gonna do and th from there i'm looking for the wings right away and working my chances from the wings find it and we have 2v1 we already going through to, uh, creating chance right okay next example Guys, uh, very often you, you will find yourself using those triangles with your striker, cam, mm, in initial formation, right? Uh, left mid and fullback. Use those triangles. Uh, on both sides of the pitch, you will have advantage 3v2. Just, just note in which side of the pitch you have those uh, advantage and use that side and create chances. The, the opponent will have no uh, chance to defend because he's at number over there, right? So use those wing plays, those triangles in the, on the wings and just run by to the side and then create chances going through mid, uh, to the middle. Yeah, we already created created just just watch how much space we already created on this side right so we're going to use our fullback who is joining the attack a um, couple more things that i want to show you here uh i'm gonna use I'm still gonna use triangle with my left striker my left mid and fullback just to create opening till the end but uh the reason i highlighted also my second striker who is playing rum because uh in this formation um, in initial build up they're wider but when i'm getting closer to the box they're gonna make this diagonal run to the box taking dragging uh with them the, uh, the opponent fullback that creates opening all the time unmarked opening for my right mid my right fullback actually in this example because we're gonna cross from left side but if you we switch mirror the sides it's gonna be same thing on the left side the diagonal run from our strikers even over here just watch how fullback is covering the run he so 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 saka is my left striker over here who's playing as an intent to left striker he's taking the fullback and i have so much space to even utilize with my left mid right so this is what you have to look for if you take advantage on one side going through middle crossing to other side you will find up open open player okay yeah play the cross we pass Did we score yeah we score in this situation if i was more composed player and better skiller in the box i, I think I, I would score definitely much more goals okay uh now i want to show you um, one thing that you have to keep looking as i said we are looking for that advantage right 2v1 3v2 if i see that uh one of the side of the pitches is like over here i have no advantage right what i mean by that this player is covered by this defender this player is covered by this defender whenever you notice that you you just can just remember one thing the second side is open on the second side you will have advantage the same thing is gonna happen uh if we just uh, switch sides if i'm gonna be playing on this side it's gonna let's say it's gonna be a little bit overcrowded i blindly can switch the play to other side and i'm gonna have advantage over there you don't have to even think about it it's gonna happen it's gonna happen now the way you want to go to this side it's up to you you can just cross right away uh but i don't like i mean it's it's not that i don't like it just sometimes those crosses are not fast enough and uh, the whole defensive line shape switches to to uh, to to other side and, and and until the ball gets to my player but uh, the way you get to the side it doesn't matter just think about that if you are overcrowded on one side right away think about going to the other side taking advantage 3v2 on the other side right we can use the middle of it, whatever, the way you get there, it doesn't matter. 
and right now from here guys you can use your imagination how we can create chances right i, I don't think i did anything here yeah, okay doesn't matter next uh thing that i want to show you you remember i spoke about the triangles i didn't include that in a uh, same example the reason for it is because there would be like too much drawing in one in one in one clip so guys again middle nothing changes first step middle padre biscuits the players who are distributing the ball second step wings on wings we are working and creating our chances till we get to the box of the opponent right what i tend to do it doesn't matter if it's left side or right side you can do it on both sides in this example when i pass to my left mid who is like in this case modric i tend to press r1 to call my striker short at the same time when he's coming short i'm pressing l1 to make my fullback run uh saka will drag with him the opponent fullback this space will opens up for my fullback to run into r1 and yeah we are opening that was just a bad idea of the past but look at how much space we have there behind okay next example guys again no chance no like uh, there's no advantage here right I already know that I'm gonna have advantage on the other side. Look how much space we have. Look how, how unmarked is my fullback. It's like kind of in a five back formation where he's unmarked. And and uh, and just, I already know that because everybody switches to the left side. So I'm already looking to cross the ball. I'm already looking for the chance to cross the ball and work my chances on the other side, okay? And from there, as I said, we're using a little bit, we're working a little bit on the sides, finding the, uh, player in the middle uh, so uh, basically usually it's gonna be uh, lamb uh, or our uh, or Pedri our false knight and then he can distribute the ball to the strikers or runner in the box right okay yeah and we already have one runners two second runner imagine how you create can create chances from here right okay next example Okay, we got the ball and I cannot stress enough how much I'm telling you to use. Even look at this. I have a lot of space here, a lot of space in front of me. I can run into, but I tend to use uh, players, uh, Biscuits and uh, Pedri in this case, who is playing striker for 9 CM uh, in this role. I use them as they intend to be my uh brains of of building up so i first step i'm trying to find them even if i have a space maybe i'll run a little bit into uh, uh forward but then i'll still try to look for them that it brings narrow as i said the opponent uh, uh team and then i look for, forward to find uh, advantages on the sides right okay so first step finding the midfield yeah from here we're looking, we're looking uh, to find this. Okay, I, I found Ram open, so that's why I use him, but I'm already looking on the side. And again, there is no advantage on the left side, uh, my left side, yeah? So I, if there is no advantage on the left side, you will have advantage on the right side. And same thing applies to to uh, like a different situation. If you have no advantage on right side, you will have it on the left side. So I already know I have. I'm gonna have advantage on this side because my fullback is making a run. I'm gonna have two v one. This player is not gonna uh, um, rush back and cover my fullback run uh, quickly. So working on the sides. And again, why I'm uh, highlighting this player as my left striker because of his run. He will drag his initial first position is causes that it's not center back who is marking him it's fullback he's gonna mark him and the fullback is gonna be dragged out of the position which gives my uh left mid in this situation great chance to run into the box even if he has a play, as, uh, initial instructions stay on edge but if he sees opening he will do that and this just line over here just shows you that just cross to him guys this is a great formation to make crosses to like totally open players right let's watch to the end opening here yeah dragging this fullback out our fullback is running to in the look at this this player is already going to mark him uh let me just go back a little bit i think i didn't record to the end unfortunately uh hold on a second 
Sorry, sorry for that. Uh, okay, over here, guys. This player is already running to mark uh, my second striker, and I already know that. And I'm gonna make a hard sw uh, switch across to to my left mid who is running to the empty space, and and we're creating great chance to score. Okay, another example. Look how familiar this example is with the previous ones. No advantage on the left side, I already know I have advantage on the right side. Now I have to find a way to get the ball as quickly as possible to this side and just find the players in, in, in the middle and create the chances from there. Okay, we use striker, but initial thought is already there that I'm gonna switch sides. Uh, I'm gonna also write stop right here because you will find yourself so many times in this situation where you have that short pass to 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 your striker to your false nine in this case and there is a great chance great like room to operate here but i'm not as skillful to do that because i, I I'm, I'm not capable of like i'm not good at doing a one and skills and with a, a one stop and because normally you can just utilize this space and score goal from here but what i tend to do when i ever pass to this uh, use the first short initial pass to the middle then i find always try to find my fullback or my cm who is even given instructions stay on edge he's just gonna help me out in this situation because he sees the chance creation that the, the and, and, and scoring opportunity over here and with a 99 position he will help me out there so initial pass to the middle i'm always right away passing to the back and basically first time passing to open space uh, lanes it, it opens space for my striker and my uh, left mid to run into and you will see that in a second that it just first time passes and i don't think about it it's just gonna happen guys pass to the middle pass back fullback or or uh, your uh, midfield in this situation just pass to your striker or the second uh, side and you will have a great scoring opportunity looking for the goal that would put them ahead yeah uh we scored actually that's amazing yeah yeah we did okay uh again middle sides no chances i will go back yeah and i'm going back because why because i already see that there's no advantage on this side everybody is concentrating on the left sides uh, on the right side sorry so left side is gonna be open right so uh, already through the middle i'm gonna look for the left side and again using the triangle i'm gonna utilize this space which my fullback will run into so those players are marked because i'm going to use them to switch sides and use the triangle between my striker left mid and fullback just to get to this position and and uh, take advantage of just one defender on the other side okay i could pass right away to fullback but i prefer this way and from here guys just use your imagination how imagination how you want to create the score and, and stuff i just didn't want to make the clips too long because i think i still keep recycling the ball because it doesn't matter okay again guys the, the only thing that i want you to learn is to with this from play, when playing this formation is spotting the advantages okay this is the, the only thing that i want you to like uh, pay attention to so no advantage here right one player is marked by one defender second player is marked by one defender side what we learn the second side if the right side is covered the left side is open so i already know that i'm gonna do everything to use advantage on the left side and create the chance from this side going to the middle how i get there how you get there it's up to you but just so simple uh, okay hold on a second did i score there or it's again didn't record till the end I think I didn't record to do it, sorry. Yeah, I think we didn't record. But look at this situation. I mean, from this situation, any like good composed player will score, right? Because it's already so simple. And as I said, my CM is on stay back, but he sees so much space in front of him. And with the stats that he has in attack, he will just join and try to, to help me out and score the goal, right? But uh, just pay attention to this side. Three players against one. You know that when we pass the middle line, 
uh, and we are between middle line and defense midfield line and defensive line those players if you don't control them they're not coming back they he will just like his right mate over here will just stand not help him out at all not cover this one this one or whatever so yeah this is what you have to look for okay another example just a, a couple uh, um, the difference between right mid and left mid right mm, those those instructions why i said i don't like to have the same uh, ap uh, approach to one side and second side because it, it just helps me out to create different uh, different scenarios and different attacking options right so right mid on stay wide so he's making this one and my left mid is on cut short uh, cut inside and come short and he's making this one also again 2v1 is gonna be on this side there is no advantage here so i'm gonna use this side work my way on a wing get getting closer to the box and just making a, a, a play to the middle from the middle find another striker cam whatever and in this case left mid who is making a great run and just score from there yeah. look at this one totally unmarked totally unmarked did we score of course we didn't okay but that w you have to admit this is a great scoring chance it's just uh, i'm i'm just rushing sometimes my chances and yeah this is uh, like a bad habit of mine okay last examples last example uh so again guys uh working on this side nothing here no advantage here just don't be afraid of crossing to the other side the way you get there it's up to you but i already know i want to get here um, the reason i mark with a white circle here because if you watch uh uh, uh close enough and and uh, concentrate on this clip you will see that when we pass initials like middle of the uh, pitch uh i still have a recycling option when the ball is gonna be around here and where is that uh, circle i will not have recycling option in the middle just keep that in mind when playing this formation whenever you're just working on on the one side and don't look for option to recycle from the uh, to the middle over here you have to find your way your way to play or you have to go through your center backs or just work on advantages given um, by your left striker in this case or left mid right don't just don't because if you lose the ball over here uh, it's 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 a very uh, dangerous counter for for uh, a great opportunity for your opponent to score so keep that in mind there is no chance to recover from here so you have to use the wing okay we cross as you can see no one here to help me out i know that because i already used that formation for 80 90 games so i know that so i'm gonna work i'm already looking for my uh uh let's say my 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 center back who is covered unfortunately so i know i have to work my way to uh, get the ball somewhere here front on the, or or left side okay so we work a little bit just a couple of dribblings and over from here look how the space opens up and we actually score yeah okay guys that that was uh, last example again damn it it's already uh, it's over 30 minutes again uh, sorry for making such a long videos guys uh, but feel free just get the tactics watch like one two examples and jump into the game because i i know it, it, it's just too long but i'm trying to to make them short i just cannot um uh, as I said, guys, if something is not understandable, uh, because English is not my first language, so if you didn't understand some of my explanation, just let me know in the comments. Also, let me know if you're at all enjoying this formation, and it, because the results might vary of your skills, I know that. And but if you're having fun, this is like the main thing for me, because as I said, this we are like ending with fifa 23 almost and just have fun guys use something different some something you, you you don't have to stick with same formation and i'm telling you if i'm having good results with it i'm are having good results with it we're ranked two it just i mean it's just great guys and 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 we are having fun just scoring sometimes different goals and uh out at smart like at smart building our opponent right okay uh feel free to comment ask questions i'm always happy to answer to all your comments and until next time i hope you guys will enjoy cheers